Well today is Sunday the 13th of June about 3 o'clock in the evening in Townsville, it's a bit bloody cool up here, it's 23 degrees today, a bit of a breeze blowing and it's going to be a cool night up here I think um, yeah, I had a big night at work last night I've done uh, 10 to 11 hours last night and I got my beautiful daughter over we're going out for uh, on a date tonight to dinner and uh, yeah I've got nothing much planned, it's Queen's birthday weekend here on Monday which is tomorrow. I've got to go and move a bit of furniture around tomorrow for a friend, so uh, look up my trailer and away I go and do that. Um, and uh, Monday I get to sleep in, thank God, um, and start late um, Tuesday evening. Yeah, no, like I said, nothing much happening here in Townsville. Been pretty quiet. Uh, I'm going to enjoy my bloody dinner tonight. I might have uh, what I had last time. The beautiful fillet uh, steak and uh, Bellinese sauce and prawns. It was absolutely beautiful. I might gorge myself tonight. But then I can starve for the next couple of days. So my fridge and freezer is pretty bloody empty. Uh, I'll have to go shopping uh, to get something for next week. So Yeah, and one thing I miss in life though, that's my mashed potato and pumpkin and uh, rockalie and all that but I don't have time to cook it overnight <coughs> excuse me because I'm working um, it makes it a bit hard when you work night shifts so uh, yeah so it's all uh, frozen or takeaway for me so uh, yeah and g'day Dave and Pa I uh, hope you're going good and all my friends and uh, like I said, my beautiful daughter's over. Her friend over the road's not here. She's just left to go home to her mother's place uh, about an hour before the staff arrived. I mean, her grandmother dropped her off, so... Uh, yeah, but she's a bit disappointed, but uh, she'll get to see her next weekend. And her little friend's name's Lily. And uh, you never guess who I picked up the other day. Three of Steph's friends, and I used to live in Bayswater Terrace. Little Ozzy and his two sisters. I picked them up. They give me their new contact number and where they live in Munningborough. So uh, if it's not this weekend, it'll be next weekend. We'll pop over and see them and say hello. So uh, little Ozzy looked at me when he walked through the door. He knew who it was. Eh? And I said to him, I said, Ozzy, do you know who I am? And he looked at me with a blank look. He's grown about six inches since the last time I seen him. And I said, I'm Stephanie's dad. Oh, he goes. And he remembered, so uh, his mum remembered, and the girls knew, but they didn't say anything. A little Aussie, he gave that blank look, uh, he knew, he wasn't quite sure. Anyhow, you three kids, uh, Steph's always asked about you ever since I've left Bayswater Terrace, and um, I'll take her over there to see you and visit you. I'll give you a call before I come over, but it'll probably be next weekend. So, uh, I'll go inside now and tell Steph who I picked up the other day and I got their contact details and yeah, she'll be happy and as long as she's happy I don't give a shit about me as long as she's happy um, I just survive day to day and yeah, take care guys and uh, like I said nothing else much going so I thought I'd just make this video and put it on and uh, Shawnee mate Thanks for your comments and uh, telling me where you work in town, mate. I'll pop in and see you, mate, when I've got a, uh, three days off. I might pop in there and have a bit of dinner and get you to cook me a nice meal. I'll get a discount. Come on, I've offered you a free ride, so I should get a good discount. Anyhow, mate, I'll catch you in town one day. You've got my address and my phone number, you know where I live. So you get bored, just pop around and see us. I'm sure we can uh, exchange a few ideas about life. Uh, that's about it from Possum. Anyhow, guys, take care and uh, catch us all later, right? Eh?